Hello and welcome to the Katie Gordon Show today's Best Country Mix and joining us here today are the Isaacs. How are you guys doing today? Awesome! Yeah. You're wonderful! Thanks for having us. Oh, thank you so much for your time. So, what are you most looking forward to being here at the Grand Ole Opry today? Just uh, singing. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Getting to be around uh, the other artists that we love and admire. Um, there's so many here, and a lot of them that we don't get to see on a regular basis. Um, Brenda Lee is an amazing artist, and uh, I just, it's not Christmas without rocking around the Christmas yes. tree. So I've got to get a picture with her today, you know, and just Absolutely. all the artists are so great. So, do you guys have any upcoming projects you want to tell us about? Well, yeah, we do. We have actually a couple new ones we're working on. We've been in the studio all year. We have one that's kind of a, an Americana country album that's coming out sometime probably next year. And then we have a, a like an Isaac-style praise and worship album that's coming out in the, uh, the fall of this year, I think in October. And we're excited. Yeah, on the Gay Fear Music one. Awesome. And um, if you guys had the opportunity to work with any artist, who would be your dream collaboration and why? Collaborate. Caden Gordon. <laughs> Oh, well, thank then you. Who would, who would the collaboration <laughs> oh, be? Who would you all say? Oh, I, oh. I mean, I, I don't know. I, I love, um, like, as far as singers, Michael Bublé would be my dream oh my artist God, to sing yes. with because I love him. And James Taylor. Who would you Those say, are Mom? My two favorites. I, I love, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I used to be a big Broadway music fan because I grew up in New York City in the Bronx, mm -hmm. so I was a big fan of Barbara Streisand. But today, I would love to sing with, I love to sing with Vince Gill. I love yeah. his voice, it's so smooth. And all the artists that come here to the Opry that are Opry members, I, I don't know that I can pick one particular one. Becky, do you know? Oh, yeah, you know? I'm a big Shania fan. Yes. And I like old country. Mm -hmm. Probably a duet with Don Williams would be pretty okay. awesome. That's Back, awesome. A, well, you already sang time. with him. I sang with him, but we didn't do a duet, and then he passed oh, away. Okay. He's my um, favorite male. Wait to heaven, that one. Probably, uh, probably, I would love to sing just a song with uh, Leon Womack, probably. Would okay. Be my, I love her. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's a great answer. So where can people learn more about you guys? Theisaacs.com. Um, it's Isaacs, like on the mm -hmm. screen. Just put .com on the end of it. And uh, we have a lot, all the social media sites, the Isaacs on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, all that stuff. So we're out there and available. And check our schedule and come see us in concert. Awesome, and it's I S A A C S. That's, That's right. right. That's Make right. sure to spell it right, or That's you won't right. find these amazing, talented people. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank you. So, where do you guys see yourselves in like the next five to ten years in your career? Oh Lord, Who we have no idea. <laughs> Working <laughs> smarter, not harder. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you have an answer, please. No, uh, we. You know, we love music. Music has always been our life. We were born and raised playing and singing. We'll always do music, where whether whether that's touring. Whether we have a, a show somewhere in a theater, who knows? Who knows what, what God has in store for us, but we're willing. Yeah. That's awesome. And is there anything else you want to share with us today before we go? We're just thankful to be on your show. Well, thank you. And uh, thanks for what you do. Yeah. And um, yeah, just if there's anything we can do for you, let us know. And guys, come see us in concert if you can. We'd love to have you. Check our tour schedule on theisaacs.com. And uh, we have all of our merch and new, new new material, and we'll be advertising when our new albums are coming out there too. And I said this the other night without thinking to somebody that came to one of our shows, and they you know, they hugged and they said, "Oh, we feel like we're your best friends." And I said, "You know what? I love for us to make friends, not fans." How's that? You're absolutely right. I mean, it was just. I mean, <laughs> She had an out-of-body experience over there. She's turned Yeah, I know. Oh, well, oh she, Beth, you're in the background. That's what I said. That's what you said. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah. Right. Friends are for life. That's yeah, right. Exactly. So that, even with our fans, we like to make friends, not right. fans. It has a different feel to it. So. You are absolutely right, because and, and then eventually they're family. That's right. That's right. Big family. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much for your time, guys. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you for having me. God bless.